951, time for Weekend Break. Hey, G. Hi, Gator. Hi, Sean. There's still time for you to make it out here to Itasca. Uh, we are at the Scottish Festival and Highland Games, and joining me now is Gus Noble. He is the CEO of the Chicago Scots, and you are very well representing today. Look at this kilt. My He's, Illinois tartan. Yes, indeed. And you said this is a tartan for all. For everyone in Illinois, just like this festival, we welcome everyone who's Scottish by birth by heritage or simply by inclination. And it is a gorgeous day. Authentically Scottish weather, you know. Yes, and plenty of time to make it out here. You're gonna have things going on all day. It goes through 10 o'clock tonight, mm -hmm. and we have uh, so many things for the whole family to do. It, well, the festival has lots of competitions, bagpiping, heavy athletics. We've got Highland cows. We've got <laughs> horses from Scotland. We haven't yet found the magical <laughs> national animal of Scotland. Oh, which is a unicorn. I learned that today, guys. The unicorn is the national animal of Scotland. So, That's true. Yes, a fave animal. But of what many. we do have are some beautiful whiskies uh -huh. and some cookies. So I was there, just about to say. There's no better way than to toast yes. with old Pulteney. Here's right. to Scotland. Here's to Scotland. Okay. Mm. Oh, there you go. Delicious. Isn't that lovely? Yes. Th this, this event supports the oldest charity in Illinois, which is the Chicago Scots. Mm -hmm. And our, our principal charity, charitable purpose is Caledonia Senior Living, a beautiful nursing home yeah. out in North Riverside, Illinois. So the festival puts a big white smile on your face but also puts lovely warmth in your heart because it's for a good cause and i love it because there's something to do for everybody doesn't all ages right we're yeah. behind us are the the really adorable uh baby cows we've got two little twin cows in this pen and a and a, and a baby bull uh, he's big but he baby and uh we've got dogs right we've, we've got, got horses later too horses right there yeah we've horses there and then um of Kids course area. all the competition and there's gonna be a space spectacular ending tonight right so if you can't make it during the day you can make it for tonight because how many bagpipers it's the biggest bagpiping championship in North America there are 46 pipe bands so all of those pipe bands there's gonna be over a thousand musicians will take the field at the same time and they'll play in unison and then there's a moment where one piper begins to play amazing grace and then they all join in it's incredible well you don't want to miss that it's gonna happen right around sunset out here in Itasca we're at the 37th Scottish Festival and Highland Games and Gus thank you so much for being with us hey listen come on out here today it's gorgeous I eat Tasca <laughs> yes and